Hello, I am Peter and I am a software developer at Capture Components, the makers of CC Scan. CC Scan's standard version is known for its ability to scan paper documents directly into Salesforce accounts, either as attachments or documents in libraries. This screencast is about CC Scan advanced version, which will save you even more time through automation of repetitive tasks. As an example, I will show you how CC Scan can be used to import electronic documents into Salesforce automatically and unattended. Let's pull up a sample document. As you can see, this is a received fax containing a copy sheet and a contract. The intent is to automatically create a standard contract record in Salesforce and automatically insert this fax as an attachment of this new record. The barcode on the fax cover page represents the name of an account. The contract record to be created is linked to this account. The title field contains a short description of the contract which is stored in the new contract record. CC Scan is organized around jobs. Out of the box, CC Scan comes with a set of default jobs that get you started right away without having to create or customize anything. However, you can enter setup mode to configure what fields users should enter and set default values. You can also create new jobs. To show how easy it is to configure a job for an automated and unattended task, let's explore the setup of the job pre-created for this screencast. Note that this setup needs to be done only once. Once set up, a job can be used over and over again. Let's start with the import section of the job. The bulk import folder is used to select a folder to periodically poll for received faxes. This could be a folder on a PC or intranet, but could also be a cloud map folder. In this case, I selected the folder mapped to my Dropbox. As you can see, this folder currently contains the sample document I showed you. Normally, my eFax software would store new faxes here. With the barcode fields, you can tell CC Scan how many barcodes to look for, the type of barcode, the quality of the barcode to expect, and where to look on the page, which in this case is the top half of the cover sheet. CC Scan allows up to 9 barcodes per page. With the regular expression fields, you can tell CC Scan how to search the text that was extracted from the document using OCR, Optical Character Recognition. A regular expression defines a search pattern. The pattern defined here is used to extract the title field on the cover page. Note that regular expressions are a standard text search language that is explained in numerous books and articles on the internet. CC Scan allows up to 9 regular expressions per page. Now let's move to the export section where the Salesforce specific fields are set up. The cryptic characters in the name field enclosed by Percentage signs represent a CC scan macro. At scan or import time, macros are replaced with real time values. For example, the R1 macro is replaced with text that match the search pattern, in this case, the title field of the sample cover page. With the attached to record field, you define the lookup and creation of Salesforce records. Remember, we want to automatically create contract records. Therefore, let's click on the Create tab and select Contracts. In the Description field, we use the same regular expression macro that we used earlier for the document name. Dynamic Create is checked because the record must be created at scan or import time instead of right now. Contract records require 
the ID of a linked account record. To specify this, we need to define a nested lookup by pressing the lookup button. The barcode on the sample cover page specifies the name of an account. Let's make sure this account exists by doing an immediate lookup. If every fax is linked to capture components, we would simply use a fixed record ID. However, since the barcodes can specify any account, we need to use a barcode macro Uh, the operator equals and a dynamic lookup. With a dynamic lookup at scan or import time, the B1 macro in the search text is replaced with the value of the first barcode, which on our sample cover page is capture components. Since I pre-created this job earlier, let me cancel out of these dialogues now that I have explained them. The final field I would like to highlight is the order run period. This is set to 600 seconds, which means that this job will pull the fax folder every 10 minutes to see where the new faxes have arrived so that they can be processed. Now that we have explored the setup of this job, let's run it and have it process our sample document. As you can see, CCScan immediately found the document and processed it. Note that 10 minutes from now, CC scan will automatically run this job again. Let's switch over to Salesforce and look for the new contract record and attachment. Let me refresh the page and as expected, a contract record was created in the contract section. And if we click on this new contract to see the details, we notice the attachment in the notes and attachment section, named after the title on the fax cover page. I hope this screencast gave you an idea of how CC Scan Advanced for Salesforce can save you time with smart imports of electronic documents. As you saw, CC Scan's automation capabilities are highly configurable. Remember that all of this automation works exactly the same for scanned paper documents too. To request a free trial version, please visit our website at capturecomponents.com. Thank you for your time.